Hi, thanks for watching this video tour for the Belfry in Sedbury, Chepstow. Here we have a three bedroomed mid terraced property set in a fantastic location. So the property is semi rural, so you have some stunning views from the, the rear of the property, from the rear garden. And the communal gardens uh, for the property are probably the nicest I've seen. Um, they're absolutely stunning. You've got a little waterfall, a little fountain, sorry. Uh, to the front of the property. You've got some beautiful garden space which has been perfectly maintained. Um, as you actually come around to the property then, you've got the garden to the front and then a little sitting area for yourself as well. So you can come home, finish work, sit down, have a nice little glass of wine, pint of beer, something like that. But literally as soon as you step foot out of your front door, this is what you see. Absolutely stunning. So we we'll make our way into the property. The property is beautifully presented in here. It's been well maintained, well looked after by the current vendor. So you could literally pick up your furniture and move straight in. You wouldn't need to do a single thing in here. So as you first come in, you've got your entrance hallway, which has access to your ground floor rooms. Then you've got your stairs leading up to the first floor. Immediately on your right, you do have a built-in cupboard, somewhere then for your shoes and coats to go. Nice handy storage space. You've also got an end of the stairs storage cupboard. So you do have your tiles then in the hallway that flows through into the kitchen. So the kitchen itself is a fantastic size. You've got plenty of wall and floor storage units and you've got ample worktop space which go around the kitchen. So you've got a range of integrated appliances and then you've got room for any freestanding appliances that you may have. Smooth plastered in here with your spotlights to the ceiling. You do have your ceramic tiled splashbacks as well and then your solid wood splashback going around the worktop. As you come up then to the hallway, the first door on your right takes you into your downstairs cloakroom. You've got your WC and your wash hand basin. It is tiled halfway up the walls. The rest of it then do have your wallpaper on there, but then you've got your beautiful tiles to the floor in. At the end of the hall where you come into your living area, you've got your lounge diner. And again, fantastic size in here as well. Nice and bright, you do have the patio windows going out into the rear garden, so you do get plenty of natural light coming in here. You've got plenty of space to fit any large living furniture that you have. I mean, the vendors have got a large three-seater and a large two-seater, and as you can see, you've still got plenty of room to be able to walk around. Beautifully done in here as well. You've got your smooth plaster ceiling with the spotlights and then your drop down lights directly over the table. And then you've got some decorated walls going around with the dado rail and the cove in. You've also got plenty of space then at the back where you can fit a large family sized dining table and chairs. The rear garden, beautifully maintained again. It is low maintenance out here. You do have a patio area as soon as you come out, somewhere for the hot tub to go, somewhere where you can sit down and relax. You do have some artificial lawn and then some decorative flower border pots going around with some mature trees and shrubs at the back. At the back of it, you literally have nothing behind you. So it is just fields in here. So imagine how peaceful this would be out here. It's private, secure, it's perfect. So we'll make our way now up to the first floor. Up on the first floor, you have your three bedrooms and your family bathroom. The master bedroom benefiting from having fitted wardrobes and an ensuite shower room. So as you come up onto your landing, you have access then to all your first floor rooms. You've also got the loft hatch providing you access into your attic space. You have a storage cupboard directly in front of you as you come up the stairs. We'll start at the rear of the property. So this is the main bedroom. This is your master room. Plenty of space in here to fit a double. If you were to lose a little bit of the bedside tables, you could probably even get a king size in there if you wanted. And then you've got plenty of space then. Well, you've got plenty of storage space. You've got a lot of wardrobe space then going around the rest of the bedroom. It is smooth plus, well, sorry, you do have smooth walls. It is papered to the walls. And then you've got your smooth plastered ceiling with the master bedroom as i mentioned you also have the ensuite shower room so you've got a modern white suite consisting of a wc 
a wash hand basin and then you've got your step in shower cubicle it is tiled from floor to ceiling in here and then you've got your skylight from the master bedroom you do have beautiful sash windows they go throughout the property but I'll just give you a little peek of what's actually behind you and as you can see nothing except for fields and then you've obviously got your parking base behind as well which by the looks of you comfortably be got parking space for two vehicles absolutely beautiful so we'll make our way to the middle of the house where you have your family bathroom again beautifully done in here as well you've got your ceramic tiles going halfway up the walls then all around the shower and then your wash hand basin and wc you've got a large mirror in there so it makes this room feel absolutely huge a big double step in shower cubicle and then you've got a bd plenty of space in here it's been really well designed it's beautiful to the front over on the left the front left of the property you've got your second bedroom i imagine you could get a double bed in here literally you could have it coming off that wall that way or literally down by there over the window it'll give you a little bit of a walkway down the side you do have some fitted wardrobes in here as well but putting a single bed in there it maximizes the amount of space which you have so you've got space then for chest of drawers to go somewhere for the tv to go on if you have any grandkids over or kids uh, coming over to 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 stay in the property absolutely beautiful and then you've got your third bedroom currently being used as an office you will get a single bed in here coming off the wall with the uh, the little lip is then for the stairs for the head height i have seen a lot of people build wardrobes in by there as well to try and maximize some of the space which you have obviously there's a little bit of dead space there so putting wardrobes coming up there beautiful use of the area but all in all decent size while you'd have in here decent size single bedroom so that concludes our video tour for this property in Belfry and Sudbury Chepstow. If you have any questions or if you're interested in viewing the property, please just give the office a call. They'll happily help you further. Thank you for watching. Bye.